block, part two, working with graphics in the content block. In this tutorial, we're going to learn how to do mouse overs. Um, a lot of times when you see a button, um, you can mouse over it and it turns to a different image. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to create a mouse over um, with two graphics. Uh, the first thing you got to realize is when you're doing a mouse over with two graphics, you got to make sure that the two graphics are um, similar size so that it doesn't um, interfere with the rest of your site. So just make sure that you uh, make um, pre design or pre, uh, pre fabricate your designs or your graphics before you put them into the website. So we want these graphics to appear right next to this graphic or next to this content. So we're going to go up to popular. We're going to select on image. We start with whatever image we want to start off with, whatever we want to, sh to show as the main graphic. So we're going to select this one as our main graphic and then this image is going to be our mouse over. This is 80 by 78 pixels and this is 80 by 78 pixels. This is also a PNG file um, which we talked about as a graphic that would allow the background to shine through. So we select our image, we push, we position it to where we want it to be. Uh, with this one being so small, we don't really need to worry about the letting and so forth. Now if we did want to add some extra spacing out here, we could do that. But for this purpose, all we're going to do is we're just going to, we're just going to add the mouse over. So we're going to go to Edit Image. We're going to go up to the Mouse Over tool. We're going to say Add Mouse Over. And it's going to ask for the second image. So we're going to select our second image. We don't need to resize it or anything else. Um, we just say save. We're going to go down, save our image. And we go to preview. and then you can see your mouse over. You can do this with as many graphics as you want to. You can create a menu. So if I wanted to, I can go back to this image. I can highlight it. I'm still working with the original image. The other image is, is just the mouse over. So if I want to link this to another page on my website as a menu option, Okay. Go to preview. Now when I mouse over it, it actually goes to the other page. Now, uh, suppose nobody knew that that was a mouse over. One of the things you can do is you can actually add a tag to this. So we're going to click on this. We're going to click on the main image. We're going to uh, go to Edit Image. And what we want to do is we want to have an alternate tag. So we're going to go back to um, Properties. And where it has Alt Tag, we're going to say uh, Click to Learn About us. Really easy. Say OK. Save. Save. OK, now when we go to preview, we mouse over it, it says click to learn about us. And we click it and it goes to the other page. You can link anything you want just like you can any of the links uh, just like you would content that's how you link a graphic too. So you just highlight the graphic link it to what you want to link it to. If you wanted to create icons for documents 
uh, they cr they provide a kind of a, a rudimentary or a, a crude version of a button for when you want to add a graphic. I mean a, a document. But if you had some nice document icons like this, you would just have a row of document icons with uh, whatever they are next to them, and then your mouse over, and you're good to go. That's how you create a mouse over.